guys, it's Venus. Not Venus, but Venus. Maybe once in your life you've been called the bad V-word. <laughs> or you've come across another term which is English pronunciation. Otaku! Japanese pronunciation. Otaku, this will at least eliminate 10% of hate in the comment section. Since these two words appear quite a lot in my comment section, I think it's the right thing to make a video about it. Either way, you probably have an interest in Japan. And that is a very bad thing. I got my script wrong. And that is absolutely not a bad thing. Because by having an interest in Japan, you are probably going to express your love somehow to the outside world for everybody to see. People will probably buy more Japanese products, go there for tourism, and this will have Japan as a country to grow. And this is not limited to Japan, but any other country. Now, Otaku is written in Katakana, which is the Japanese alphabet used to write foreign words. But Otaku is not a foreign word, it is a um, slang word. Now, if you're really, really enthusiastic and knowledgeable about your hobby, it could be gaming, animation, idols, music, cars. You can call yourself an otaku or other people, but preferably as a kind joke. Because when you use Google Japan and look up for images of otaku, this is what comes up. So, you do the math. You do the math, my child. And when you call yourself an otaku, do it jokingly. Don't be really serious about, I'm an otaku. <sighs> I hope the comment section calms down, everybody can hold hands and rest in peace. No, I mean, um, you do you. And boop, bye bye boo.